This is a preparation of an isolated adult temporal bone. To orient you, this is anterior, this is posterior, this is superior, and this is inferior. This is the zygomatic process, and this is the external acoustic meatus. This preparation can be opened so that the medial wall of the middle ear can be seen. Identify the oval window into which fits the footplate of the stapes and the round window. Anteriorly, two longitudinal channels can be identified, separated by a bony septum. The upper channel houses the tensor tympani muscle, and the lower channel is part of the auditory tube, which leads to the nasopharynx. Intracranially, on the anterior slope of the petrous ridge, there is a slight groove indicating the position of the greater petrosal nerve. When the bone lateral to this groove is removed, the semi-canals for the tensor tympani and auditory tube will be exposed. If removal of the bone is extended posteriorly from this area, the epitympanic recess with the head of the malleus and body of the incus will be exposed.